Hi everyone, it's Nati. Um, I had recorded this video yesterday, but since then I've got an update, so I am re-recording. But this will be my update on Project Level Up. And we're actually going to be rolling out a palette, so I'm very excited about that. So, the palette I was working on was Alba Palette from Odin's Eye. Um, quick recap on the project in case you're not familiar with this project. But, um, so the whole goal of this project is to rotate through your palettes and every level you have a certain number of uses and a certain number of shadows that you have to hit pan on. So level one is probably the easiest one. You really just have to use every shadow once and hit pan on one eyeshadow. So I had picked this one and, um, last time around there were four shades that I was really nervous to use. So these bottom ones right here, um, by my face. Those are a lot darker in colors I don't really gravitate towards, so I was really nervous about using them, but I used them. And as you can see, I've hit pan, the tiniest pan right there. Um, so I'm counting that as my hitting pan, so I get to roll this one out. Um, also update, I've been recording on my phone because I can't find the adapter for my laptop, so until I decide to pull the trigger and buy a new one, I will be recording on my phone because I don't want to buy a new one. <laughs> so I did already roll and I cheated. Usually I like to do it for you all to see, but you know, given that that app is on my phone and I'm recording on my phone, it's hard to do that. But I rolled and the palette I got is the Tarte Maneater. I got this one this past December and I'll be honest, I haven't really used it. So I'm excited that this one got... Um, rolled in. It's very pretty. I don't know that I would have bought this for myself, but my aunt gave it to me. So I'm going to be working on this one. Um, the goal is to use every eyeshadow twice and then hit pan on two eyeshadows. I don't know if I'll actually hit pan, so we shall see. Um, I'm thinking probably the lighter shades would be good to hit pan on. So this might be one that stays in my project for a while just because hitting pan on eyeshadows is tough. And even though these look like maybe they're not as deep, it, I think it's still going to be a challenge. So I think I'm going to try and focus on some of these eyeshadows as liner. That'll probably help me get through them quicker. Um, and yeah, so we'll see. So stay tuned on that update. But this one is going back into storage for now. Um, I really did enjoy this one. It was a really nice palette. If you like everyday colors. And even those dark ones were not like incredibly dark to the point that I couldn't use them. They were just a little intimidating because it's not colors that I wear daily anymore. So anyways, that's the update. Stay tuned for more and I'll see you next time. Bye.